Good evening, everyone. Great new release tonight. We've got another full case of 2019 Panini Elements football uh, coming at you. 12 box. Pick your team number three from jazbeescasebreaks.com. Big thanks to all of these folks for getting into it. Now, there is a team random. You can see some blank uh, names right here. Got to do that team random. Going to randomize people's names. Name on top is going to get the Cardinals. Next name, Redskins. Next name, Broncos. And the next name, New York Football Giants. Everyone else will get spots in the uh, the mini helmets break. Oh, that re which reminds me. I'll do it after the thing. Um, okay, so there's this. I forgot to take the list from the second from break two. Big thanks to these folks for getting into it, for giving it a shot. Good luck. Cross your fingers. Top four, get a team. After nine times, six and a three. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and ninth and final time. After nine times, top four, Nick, Jarrett, Ryan, Eric. Congrats. All right. So Nick Stanley, you get the Cardinals. Good luck. Jarrett K with the Redskins. We'll put that little symbol next to your name so you know they come from a team random. Ryan Redman with the Denver Broncos. A little Oppo Joe Mojo. And Eric J with the Giants, New York Football Giants. So you got your teams for a fraction of a price. Good luck. Nice and baseball player Mike Leak had a perfect game going to the ninth inning, but still ended up with the complete game shutout. How many pitches, Chris? He had a really efficient game too. All right, there's the fresh case right there. Give me just one second here, otherwise I'm I know I'm gonna forget. I gotta grab those names. From pick your team two, the two two team round. I'm all squared away. Good to go. Thanks, everybody. All right, here's the official printout. Thanks for your patience. There it is. Thanks for spending your Friday night with me, too. Pick your team three, 12 boxes, four cards per box. Some nice stuff. Being on plate autos are really cool. Steve Nolson with that last bot mojo. Panthers. I haven't seen too many Panthers, so maybe this is the case with all of them. So good luck to everybody. Yeah, you lucked out, Nick Stanley. Now let's see if this case cooperates with you. So getting the team is just half the battle. Then you gotta, you gotta wonder if any of these 12 boxes will actually cooperate with you. All right, good luck everybody. Got Hunter Renfro is going to help us out. That's the non autograph plate. And there's Elements of Success. That's a catch. David Montgomery, three out of 49. Bears. Javier with the Bears. Got the Bears straight up.
looks like points on the bottom. There's Noah Fant, 21 out of 75. Oppo Joe Mojo going to Ryan Redmond, who also got this team in a team random. And that's a good chunk of points, though. We'll randomize that to one person in the break. And that's for the Raiders. It's to 25. The 600 points, um, if there's more points, we'll collect them into one lot. We'll re we randomize them as a lot here. There's DK Metcalf, radioactive rookie, 65 out of 149. That is for Eric Wine and the Seahawks. Could the Seahawks have an interesting season this year? Got some DK Metcalf. Russell Wilson's always a threat. Rework that defense a little bit. There's Marquise. What about the Ravens? There's Marquise Brown, 27 out of 75. Hope springs eternal around this time of year, ladies and gentlemen. Glenn Campbell, unable to hit in those stupid team randoms, but... Guess what? I got you. I got you a Raven out of here. You know what will Marquise Brown do? The autograph on the bottom is Terry McLaurin, Redskins. Goes to Jarrett K, who got randomized the Redskins. Fifty-seven of ninety-nine on that, and there's DK Metcalf again. I don't know. Ravens could be an interesting thing. What about the Redskins? We haven't talked too much Redskins football. Dwayne Haskins? Now he, if him succeeding in the NFL or finding some early success in the NFL would be hashtag good for the hobby. I want him to do well. There's radioactive rookie Marquise Brown jersey this time. Another one for Glenn. No, Chris Maxwell not optimistic on the Redskins. Three and thirteen. Don't they have a decent defense? Dwayne Haskins could be inspiring on the offensive side of the ball. There's Benny Snell Jr., 114 out of 199. What is What are the Steelers going to do, Michael Gallucci? What's Benny Snell going to do? Distractionless Steelers? Does that reinvigorate them? Or will we find out that they, they needed Antonio Brown and Le'Veon Bell all along? Don't know. And behind Brady is Hakeem Butler, Nick Stanley with the Arizona Football Cardinals. Got that in a team random. Nick L saying Dwayne Haskins will be the best QB out of this draft long term. And that Nick Stanley is 75 out of 150. Let's see if we can find his teammate. There's Tom Brady, 2 out of 75. That goes to the Patriots. That's for Ed Knox. Will Brady start to look, Brady look old all of a sudden? Is that dynasty over? Do they have another run in them? There are a lot of questions. Cardinals, how does Kyler Murray do? Andy Isabella, Christian Kirk, David Johnson still on that team. That's an interesting team right there. New head coach. I think offensive-minded head coach. I don't know. Wait, who else is on the Redskins that... Oh, Keenum is on the Redskins. I'll bet Keenum gets to start, right? first few weeks of the season. There's Miko Hardman to 149. Chiefs, that'll be for Zach. 
We got neon signs. TJ Watt, 3 out of 10 for the Steelers. Michael Gallucci. This is where the Steelers are, Mike. Break 3. Nice TJ Watt. And behind Ray Lewis is... Nice, Alexander Mattison. Looks like a white out ink autograph. That's pretty neat. Nice contrast there. Vikings. That goes to Eric J with the Vikes. Right, right, right. Yeah, and, and the Redskins have Darius Geis as well, who is who had a great camp before he tore his ACL. That's for Glenn and the Ravens. So they got they got some pieces. I know, Eric, finally, right? What about, uh, I mean, what about quarterbacks, younger-ish quarterbacks that need to step it up this year just to take it to the next level? I, th I think Derek Carr has got to do that. You know, he's kind of had some up-and-down seasons, right? He's got to put together a complete season. I think he can this year with uh, some good weapons. I feel like James Winston's got to do it. You know, he's got to take it to the next level. Mariota's got to take it to the yeah the EA saying Mariota's got to take it to the next level. They all got good ceilings. There's Hunter Renfro. We've seen them have some incredible moments, right? And decent stretches of of great moments, great starts. There's Hunter Renfro for my Raiders. That'll go to Arturo Cousins. There you go. Josh Rosen. Yeah. What can he do in his second year? Jeremy agrees with the Winston. There's Bill Bates, 38 out of 125. I guess I was thinking more like fourth, fifth-year quarterbacks, I guess. Second-year quarterbacks, you know, I'll give uh, – this is for the Cowboys, Grego with old-school Bates. I'll give the first couple – first two or three years – you know, I, I give give the QBs a little bit of a leash. First round QBs a bit of a leash. We've got Michael Hardman Jr. That's a cool autograph. That goes to Zach and the Chiefs. But yeah, EA thinks see that that's a thing from from that Mariota class, Mariota Winston class. There's ten out of twenty five as well. It's it's kind of like a put up or shut up kind of thing. It's like what do you got? Otherwise, people start to think. You know, you got to start looking the – I guess you're getting close to the end of – you know, I guess you're, you you kind of know what you have. And it's either like, all right, are you going to – you know, yeah, have there been injuries? Have there been, you know, poor pieces put around those quarterbacks? Yeah, there has. The Raiders and Titans too. But, yeah, Carson Wentz I think has a lot to prove, right? Can he stay healthy? We've seen him play brilliantly, have an MVP caliber season until regular season until major injuries. Can he stay healthy? Can the Eagles keep him healthy? There's elements of success. Alexander Matheson, dual relic to Eric J. Vikings. Right, and right, and there's contract extensions to think about too with these quarterbacks. Right? That's what you know, it's kind of what the Cowboys are dealing with, Dak Prescott. Twenty nine out of fifty, Tyler Boyd. Deshaun Watson, yeah, has has all Alfred's right. Deshaun Watson has to kind of see he's shown moments of brilliance as well, but he's also got to put it together over the course of an entire season. Tyler Boyd autograph, nice looking one for Rashad and the Bengals. And we got Nick Bosa. Nice, Bosa brothers on the West Coast. Glenn Campbell with the Niners. There you go, Glenn. 25 out of 35. And there's Aaron Rodgers, 46 of 75. He'll get a fresh start, new coach. 
all that sort of stuff. Packers with that plate on. Chris Maxwell is saying, Winston, Jameis, ne never, ever, ever learn. Same dumb mistakes year after year. This is this is it. This is I think this is the year where where you gotta you know where James Winston really has he's shown some talent you know but he's just got to put it together across the entire course of the season. All right, there's Mariota played on top. Speaking of Mariota, there's no offense to 149 Broncos. Ryan Redman. How will Joe Flacco do in Denver? Flacco's got a pretty decent team around him. We got Miles Boykin. Rookie neon signs, 10 out of 25. Gold ink autograph. That looks sharp. That goes to Glenn Campbell and the Ravens. Purple Birds. And Niners, Glenn Campbell, he's heating up. White out ink autograph on that plate. Glenn has the Niners. Glenn, forget about those team randoms. You seem to be picking them just fine. At least in this one. 11 out of 25. And there, there he is. There's Mariota. We're talking about him. Maybe we could find that new receiver that he's going to hopefully throw to and save his career in Tennessee. That's for EA. EA's thinking, what, Mar NFL Network guys, the Titans only three and third. That, that AFC South is tough. I think the Texans are going to want to be better. I think the Colts are going to be better with a full season of healthy Andrew Luck. I think the Jaguars are going to be better. No, Ashton, A.J. Brown, the guy that's going to help everybody. There's Drew Locke, 30 out of 99. If A.J. Brown does well, he'll give, he'll give Corey Davis more room to operate, gives... Derrick Henry allows Derrick Henry to do his thing. Opens up a lot of space for both players. No, I think Ashton. I think Corey Davis is still on, still on the Titans. If I'm, unless I've missed the news in the last month, my head has been in baseball mode. Ryan Redman with the Broncos. I'm saying, you know, Corey Davis hasn't shown that he can be like the lone receiver that can do it all, Julio Jones style, right? But he's a good receiver. He just needs. Needs a little little more attention taken away from him. If A.J. Brown can do that, that would be a good thing. There's Jarrett Stidham. Is that future Tom Brady? 60 out of 125. Ed Knox with the Pats. Behind Darius Leonard is Trent Dilfer for the Buccaneers. Chris Maxwell. That's what I'm saying, Ashton. Yeah, I, I wasn't trying to dog Corey Davis, but I, you know, he's just a kind of a different kind of receiver. You know what I mean? So, but if he gets a little bit of help, he he can definitely really shine. There's Darius Leonard, Colts. That plate will go to Glenn Campbell as well. To Glenn, that was 37 out of 75, right there. All right, final third of this case, ladies and gentlemen. So far, so good. Still a lot of hits left. Don't worry. Still a third of the case left. So we haven't hit yet. Cross those fingers. All right. We got Alexander Matheson again. Radioactive rookie to 149 for Eric J. And the Vikings. Another Viking. For the Dolphins, Kenyon Drake, Jerry Bennington, 10 out of 75. Dolphins, new head coach. 
I don't know what's going to happen there, but let's see if Josh Rosen can, can really get comfortable down there. Plate auto is Kyler Murray. There it is, Nick Stanley. Arizona football Cardinals, Kyler Murray. On plate autograph. 71 out of 75. I hope he stays alive this season. Doesn't get destroyed. Because if, if he doesn't get destroyed, he's going to play well, I think. You know? And that would be hashtag good for the hobby. Which is good for business. It's good for you as a collector. Good for everybody. Let's all root for Kyler Murray. There you go, Nick Stanley. Nice one, man. Congrats. Wait, what was the number again? 71 out of 75. All right. You're welcome, man. And there's James Conner, plate. 71 out of 75. Same number as the Kyler. Stanley can grab one of those hovercrafts, drive it up here, pick it up. I'll meet you at the water. Thirty-three out of one forty-nine. Radioactive rookie Debo Samuel, Glenn Campbell, Niners. We've got Billy White Shoes Johnson. Nineteen out of one twenty-five. Oilers, which of course goes to the Titans, which goes to EA. Getting the old school Oiler. Yeah. All right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Absolutely, man. I'll be here. I think we'll... we'll um, the store's not done yet, but I think it would be cool for you to see it because then you could see... Um, like when it's done, you'll be like, wow, what a, what a big change. Are you, EA who? What are you talking about? You don't remember Billy White Shoes Johnson? Oilers legend Billy White Shoes Johnson? I thought, you were, I thought you were a football fan, man. Everyone knows about Billy White Shoes Johnson. You know? He was one of the first players to display elaborate celebrations in the end zone. He was the original wide receiving diva. Man. Can't believe you don't remember him when he was on the Oilers and a kickoff returner. Celebrate touchdown dances with the, as, the, as the funky chicken. Oh, that's pretty. It was one of the first touchdown celebrations in league history, man. The dances along with his footwear made Johnson popular among Oilers fans. No, this is not Google. I'm, I'm, I'm saying this off of memory, my, my deep, deep football knowledge. My, my expertise is in mid-70s Oilers. We got Nikhil Harry for the Patriots. Um, shoot us an email too, Nick Stanley. Let, let, let the crew know that you'll be stopping by so they can... What time are you thinking? I'm in, a, I'm in here at the shop a little bit before 3 o'clock Pacific. 21 out of 25, Nikhil Harry. Nice white out ink autograph for the Patriots. Ed Knox. And there's Kenyon Drake. Yeah, Chris remembers Billy White Shoes Johnson. Right, Chris? Never remembers him. Man. Johnson is currently... Um, if you, I mean, I knew this just from all the research I've done on, on Billy White Shoes Johnson, but if you didn't know, he, uh, he's currently an assistant varsity football coach at Duluth High School, Duluth, Georgia. All right, we've got Meagle Hardman Jr. 
30 out of 49. Chiefs are going to have a lot of speed out there. Mahomes is going to be able to air it out a lot. That should be pretty terrifying. That goes to Zach and the Chiefs. Michael Hardman, Tyreek Hill. And there's Leighton Vander Esch, 11 out of 25. Cowboys. Who's got the Cowboys? Grego with the boys. It's your new Sean Lee right here. Cowboys have an interesting team. Got some good offensive pieces. Got a really solid defense. That coaching I'm not a fan of, but Jason Garrett wasn't extended, so. Um, I think Valiant is next, and I don't think there's anything else after that. There's future Andy Dalton, maybe? Ryan Finley. Actually, you want him to be better than Andy Dalton, right? That goes to Rashad and the Bengals. There's Christian McCaffrey. To 25. Yeah, you're welcome, Grego. But we want him to be better than Dalton. That's 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 the point, right? Oh no, the Dodgers are not going to cover. I don't, I don't like those run lines, ladies and gentlemen. I, I took the Dodgers minus one and a half. They're they're winning two one. Kenley Jansen, top of the ninth, already got him out on the Marlins. So now I would need the Marlins to score to tie and then the Dodgers to hit like a two-run walk-off home run or something like that. That's, or no, it could only be a home run, right? Two-run home run. It's the only chance I got. All right. Out of 149, radioactive rookie. Although Chris just told me that I had financial interest in the Giants and they walked it off. Beat the Mets one nothing in 10. Another extra innings game for them. No offense uh, for Ryan Redman. We got Nikhil Harry. One of one, Nikhil Harry, in the last box. Nikhil Harry, I like your auto, but feel free to use the entire canvas. You might be able I just want to take that and stretch that auto out a little bit. But there you go, Patriots. Ed Knox with the one of one, Nikhil Harry. And all aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo woo! And we've got more points. That's a thousand points. Winner take all. It's pretty interesting. There's Kenyon Drake to 75. You can do some damage with a thousand points. You can sell those, sell a thousand points. They, they go for some decent money. All right. Let's go back to. Oh, whoops. Let's go back to the dice right here and get a blank list and let's get everyone the same. Everyone has a shot at the 1,000 points. So even if you didn't get anything, it's as good as a hit, 1,000 points. It's a lot. Let's randomize the list. Six and a one, seven times. One, two, three, four, five, six, and a one, seventh and final time. Name on top after 7,000 points. It's a good chunk of points going to... Jared K. There you go, Jared. I don't think there were a lot of Redskins in there, but 1,000 points going your way. Thanks very much, everyone. Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. We'll see you next time for the next break. Bye-bye.